here they are for one and all The moments are about to call Come on and sit down here with me They're here for you on your TV They are the moments They are the moments So come with me, give me your hand I'll take you up to moving land You can fly just like a bird And sing the best song ever heard There were the moments 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 Winter was just round the corner. And that was the time of year for Moomin to get restless. <sighs> Snuff can't wait! Oh. Because this was the time of year for Snuffkin to leave Moomin Valley on his yearly trek south. Papa, that bonfire looks inviting. Oh, you're up already. Mm-hmm. We're buried in leaves this morning after that wind last night. Yes, winter's on the way. Oh, this is a lovely bonfire. Yes, isn't it? I guess we're hibernating again this winter, are we, Moomin, Papa? Hmm, well, of course. We always hibernate in the winter. If Snufkin says I could go with him, couldn't I give this winter a miss and hibernate longer next year? Mart. Oh, please, Moomin, Papa. Snufkin would rather go alone, I think, Moomin. But I might get him to change his mind. But Snufkin's not really a person who likes to be pressed. Why not? Well, he's a very solitary person. His winter trip is the only time he can really be alone for a while. I know, but I was just hoping... Snufkin likes you very much, I know that. And I think that's why he stays in Moomin Valley for the rest of the year. But at heart, uh, he's a vagabond and he needs time away from us. He's not a family man, so he's free to do as he wants. And as his friend, you should try to understand. I know you'd like to go with him, but I don't think it'd be such a good idea. He'd really hate to turn you down, I know. I guess. But he'd have to. Oh. <gasps> oh. Why aren't they biting? I haven't had a proper catch for days. Getting too cold, is it? Mm. When are you leaving? Huh? You're about to leave, aren't you? Yes. Could I ask you something? What? Don't go without telling me. But why? I'm always sad when you leave, even though I know you'll return in the spring. Yeah. Me too, sort of. That's why this year I'd plan to leave without saying anything. But it makes me even sadder if I can't say goodbye properly. I'd like to wish you good luck and all that. I miss you so much when you're away. Please, Snufkin. Moomin, I have a better idea. I won't leave until after you've started hibernating. Then you won't miss me, will you? You're right. That's a great idea, Snufkin. Then we wouldn't really part at all, would we? Nope. 
because I promise to be back here in Moomin Valley before you've even woken up. Wonderful! What a super idea! Hey, Moomin! Oh, Sniff! Moomin, come here a minute. There's something funny caught up in a tree. What do you mean, funny? I don't know exactly. Never saw anything like it before. Snorkmane and little Mai found it first, but it's too high to get it down. Okay, I'll come have a look. Be careful! Careful! What is it, Moomin? I know what it is. It's a kite. A what? A kite is something you fly in the sky. But it has no wings. No, you send it up against the wind on a string. Careful, Moomin! Just a little bit more! kite looks like. Looks broken to me. Uh, I'm sure we can fix it and make it fly. Let's see. Oh, no. The string must have broken when someone was flying it, and the wind blew it down into the tree. Well, why don't we repair it? Yes, let's. Looks pretty badly broken to me. Well, I don't know. We'll have to see. <laughs> it is a kite, isn't it? Hmm. Can we mend it? Maybe. A very odd kite. It must have come from far away. You think it can be repaired? Of course. Well, come on then, Snork. We'll help you repair it. I can repair it without your help, as long as you can find us some really long string. Strong, but not too thick if possible. I think I have what you need. Some string. Good. Excellent. I'll start immediately. <laughs> Exciting project. I haven't flown a kite for years. I do hope that string is long enough. Snork, is this okay? Fine. Who's gonna fly it? I'll do it. Okay, Sniff. Moomin, hold the kite up high. Like this? Hmm. All right, Sniff, are you ready? Yep, I'm ready. Don't let go till I say when. Win, Moomin! Ho! Uh-oh, it's fallen. Try again, and this time start running, and when the wind catches the kite, you start paying out the line. All right, fine. Hold it up again, Moomin. Right. Ready? Yep, I'm ready. Let go of it! <laughs> Is it going up yet? No, it isn't. Stop, Sniff! You're breaking the kite! <sighs> I don't think this kite's any good for anybody. The kite's fine. It's just that the wind is too weak. You're right. We'll have to wait for it to get stronger. 
City, though, we certainly had a good strong wind yesterday. <gasps> is it okay? Mm -hmm. I think the wind is getting stronger, Moomin. Hold the string, Moomin. Mm -hmm. Boy, this wind is really strong. Can I let out the string now? Do it slowly, mind. All right. Let me do it, Sniff. Come on, it's my turn. I'm afraid you can't, little boy. Why not? Because you don't weigh enough to hold it. I'm very strong. Moomin's quite right. You go up with it. Sniff. Yes, Papa? Do you think I could hold it for a while? Well... Yes, you'd like that. Hold it really tight, then. Oh, I could do this long before he was born. <laughs> Oops. Oh, what's happening? Papa, wind it up quickly! <laughs> I'm winding, I'm winding. Faster! Oh. Wind it faster! Oh, oh, it's it's oh, 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 it's gonna oh, fall! Oh, 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 oh. That was definitely not my fault. Of course it wasn't. With such a strong wind up there, I think we have to lower the center of gravity a bit. The kite's all right, Papa! Hmm, maybe it would take me with it. That's it. I suppose that's to stop it from spinning around, is it, Snork? Yes, that's right. What is it? Huh? Listen, I'm gonna ride that kite. What did you say? Shh. I think it's going to be okay now. If I hold on really tight, I think I could have a wonderful ride on that kite. Yes, maybe it'd be wonderful while you're up in the sky, but you've seen how fast it can come down again. But the snork just said it won't fall down again. Even so. I'm gonna do it. But no one must see me or they might try to stop me if they guess what I'm up to. Oh, please don't do it. Shh. What are you doing? Listen carefully. Yes? When we fly the kite next time... Huh? What are you two whispering about? We weren't, Snork Maiden. I was just saying to Sniff that the kite wouldn't fall down again. It won't. Snork has fixed it. But you can't be absolutely sure. And you'll be holding the kite, won't you, Sniff? Me? Now then, do you want to do it, Moomin? Yes, and this time I'll let out all the line. And Sniff, you can hold it up, okay? Yes, that's fine. No! I'm counting on you, Sniff. And so am I, Sniff. Mm. Are you sure you'll be all right? Of course I will, silly. Well, I'm not so sure. Why don't you keep your eyes closed, then? Good idea. Okay, Sniff, let go of it when I say ready. All right. Ready!
It's very high. Must be some wind up there. It's flying really well, isn't it? Certainly is. Oh, 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 oh. This is getting bumpy. Oh! oh, oh. What's that? I'd say there's something very strange happening on that kite. Uh, what is it? I can't see properly from here. I saw something. Uh, could it be a bird, maybe? The kite has turned again. But it wasn't a bird. Uh, or a twig or something, then. I doubt Can't it. you see the back of the kite from where you are, Sniff? No moment, Mama, because my eyes are closed. Oh? I think I know who it is. Little Mai. What? what? Oh, no, I haven't seen Little Mai for a while. She seems to have disappeared. Well, don't ask me anything. I know nothing at all about it. Sniff, what do you mean? No, oh, she was dead set on riding the kite. I couldn't stop her. What? Moomin, bring it down very slowly. Oh. Oh. Take it easy, Moomin. That wind is strong. It could break the line. But that was one of Grandma's best strings. It's the knot I worried about. What knot? The one between our line and the bit that was still hanging from the kite when we found it. The line is fine, but the knot is another matter. The, oh, uh, oh, my hat. Oh, dear. Oh. Yeah. oh. Tight, little Mai. That wind, it's getting stronger. Oh, this is more scarier than I thought. Oh. Uh, uh, I'll just have to hang on as best as I can. Oh. Don't move around so much. I can't help it. Oh, it's almost down. What? Oh. Oh. Sniff, get a move on. Right. Snork, pull yourself together. Yes, all right. She's being blown away towards Lonely Mountains. Mama! Oh, I do hope little Mai really is indestructible. Where in the world is this kite taking me? Now she's going towards the forest of witches. She'll be all right if she fell into a tree, wouldn't mm. she? I can't see her. There's no sign of her. Well, I'm almost sure she was heading this way. Uh. Yeah, what is it, Sniff? Imagine she might have fallen somewhere. She might be lying there waiting for help. Oh, stop imagining things, Sniff. She's still up there. I'm sure of it. Huh? What is it, Papa? I saw something up there. Little Mai? No, Sniff. No, it looked more like the Hobgoblin riding his panther through the sky. Really? Did you see that? Did you? You found Little oh, Mai! Oh, oh, oh. No, the Hobgoblin! Huh? Then it was him. Oh, forget the Hobgoblin! We're looking for Little Mai, and all you can think of is the Hobgoblin! <laughs> Oh, stop it! You're hurting me! 
Where could she be? This is no good. We'll never find her wandering about like this. Moomin, over here. You found her? There she is. Try to cheer up, Snork Maiden. I'll try. Don't worry, Snork Maiden. Moom and Papa will find her for sure. Eh? Hey? Mama! Snork Maiden! <laughs> Little, Little boy! boy. Oh. <laughs> oh! I'm so glad to see you. But I just knew you'd be all right. Like Moom and Mama said, Little Mai really is indestructible, but just possibly it served her right to have her hair pulled. Mm -hmm. There's still no sign of Little Mai. No. Be careful, Moomin! Finally, Moomin was rescued too, but he almost certainly had a far worse scare than little Mai. <laughs>